Careful, careful, dude, careful, uh, careful, dude, careful, careful, dude, careful. Shut up, Joseph. What's up? Sorry, I'm sorry. I got it. Oh, dude, that was so close. I'm so glad we're playing Jenga. Yeah, money Jenga. All right, Richard, it's your turn. Mm, which piece do I want to go for? Oh, this one. Oh, okay, careful, oh, oh, careful, oh, oh, careful. careful. Oh, oh, you lost. Yeah, you lost. Actually, it looks like I'm winning. All right, guys, so what game do you want to play now? How about hide and seek? Oh, oh let's play hide and seek. Yeah, I'm really good at hide and seek. Okay, okay, I'll be it. All right, Joseph, you and Richard hide, okay? Oh, okay, then. I'm going to count to ten. One, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, where are they at? All right, guys, I'm going to find you. Just where are you at? <laughs> Are you behind the teddy bear? <laughs> no. <laughs> Are you inside that popcorn bucket? <sighs> no. <laughs> Joseph, you're there. Oh, dude, how did you find me? You wouldn't stop laughing. Oh, darn. I need to shut my mouth. <laughs> oh, yeah, you do. Now I gotta find Richard. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. Richard? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cha -ching! Oh, I'm allergic to your poor air! Well, I got you, Richard. All right, Joseph, it's your turn. Oh, man. Okay, dude. Well, who's that? I don't know. Oh, let me see who it is. Okay. Uh, hello? Hey there. I'm here to pick up my son, Richard. Okay. Richard, your dad's here. Oh, thank God. Thanks for picking me up, Dad. It's so poor here. My allergies were acting up. Oh, and by the way, Junior, I accidentally clogged your toilet. Sorry. But you clogged my toilet? Wait, you clogged his toilet? Yeah, I accidentally used too much money when I was wiping. Too much money when you were wiping? You know you're only supposed to use one bill at a time? Show me. All right, right this way. See, Dad? There it is. That's it, mister. You are grounded. Grounded for what? You know you're only supposed to use one bill when you wipe, and you're wiping like we have endless amounts of money, which we do, but you need to learn the value of money. So I think you need to get a job. A job? You poor! Yeah. That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to get you a job. And I think you need to work at McDonald's. McDonald's, ew, poor people food. Now you get over here and let me smack those stupid AirPods out of your stupid head. Come here. Come on, give me the other side. Come on. All right, you'll get those AirPods back when you've earned them. Now let's go to McDonald's. Welcome to your first day at McDonald's. How you feeling? Poor. Exactly. That's how we all feel until we start making $15 an hour, then we'd be lower middle class. Well, how much am I making now? $8.45 an hour. $845 an hour? That's not too bad. No, 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 my silly white boy. $8.45. Ew, poor! Exactly. Let me show you the food layout. See, we got hamburgers right here, nuggets there, french fries, lettuce, and tomatoes. See, all this stuff was already made yesterday, okay? We just leave it out to give it flavor. And this stuff right here is the stuff people return. See, we just keep passing out the window till somebody accepts it. Now let me show you how to make a burger. On a traditional burger, you got meat, cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, ketchup, mustard, and mayonnaise. See, I know that's a lot, but I got a song to help you remember. First you add the meat, then you add the cheese, don't forget the lettuce, then you add tomatoes, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. You've got to be kidding me. No, no. It's very catchy. Come on, sing it with me. First you add the meat, then you add the cheese. Don't forget the lettuce, then you add tomatoes. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. I'm not singing that poor song. Do you want to get paid? <sighs> yeah. Come on, sing it with me. First, First you, you add the meat, meat then, then you add, add the cheese. cheese. Don't, Don't forget, forget the lettuce, lettuce then you add tomatoes. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Yeah. Ketchup, mustard, White boy got rhythm. Somebody at the drive-thru. Okay, get ready to make a sandwich and don't forget the song, all right? All right. Oh, uh, hello. I'm ready to order. <sighs> Another one. Hey, hey, don't be throwing bananas in my drive-thru. Uh, I'm ready to order. What you want? Uh, can I get, uh... Drop fresh, a large fry with no salt, also drop fresh with salt packets in the bag, a plain cheeseburger, and an ice cream cone. Ah, uh, ice cream machine, bro. Mm-hmm, of course it is. Well, then in that case, I'll just take Kool-Aid to drink. Man, we don't sell Kool-Aid. We only got high C. Oh, I can see that you high, because your ice cream machine always broke. Look, is that all you want, ma'am? Yeah. All right, your total is 1738. All right, you accept EBT? No. You accept food styles? No. Hmm. What well, can I get your discount? Look, it's my, it's my discount, ma'am. Look, look, can you please pull up for 
So we can get your food. I ain't pulling up food. There ain't nobody behind me. Oh my God. Look, look, I'll have your food in a minute, ma'am. And they want fifteen dollars an hour. Yeah, you slam that window. All right, Rashad, what we have- My name's Richard. Listen, Rashad, I'm trying to teach you something. Look, what we have here is what we call a bad customer. You can tell from a mile away, it's a dead giveaway. You can tell by the, by the color, the color of their car. Their car? Yeah, yeah, she was driving a red car. People who drive red cars are always mad. Something about the color red. But uh, do you know what we do to bad customers? What? <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Now she wanted a burger and some nuggets and fries dropped. So can you drop them on the ground and take 10 minutes doing it? She also wanted an ice cream cone, but uh, we always tell the customers that the ice cream machine is broken. To be honest with you, we don't even have an ice cream machine. I don't even know why it's on the menu. But uh, get to making her food and I'll be right back. Okay. All right. What do we do again? Oh, oh yeah, the saw. Uh, something about the meat, then you grab some nuggets, how about some fries, don't forget the tomatoes, uh, ketchup, 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 all right, I'm done. Let me see how you did. Boy, what, what is this? It's a cheeseburger. The song, boy, the song. I sing the song. You got a lot to learn. Let me just wrap this up and give it to her. Okay. What take you so long? Hey, what I told you about throwing bananas in my drive-thru? Look, look, here's your food, ma'am. My food hit the ground. I'ma need you to make me some more. Look, I'm not making another burger for you, lady. Well, I also had nuggets and fries. Look, just have a good day, okay? Let me speak to your manager. I am the manager. All right, then, well, let me speak to the owner. Look, if you want to talk to the owner, how about you call old McDonald himself? He lives on the farm, E-I-E-I-O. Well, I do you one better. I'll call Mayor McCheese. Well, call Mayor McCheese, then. All right, this ain't the last you heard of me, and they want $15. All right, Randy, I want you to work the drive through because I am scratched. How do I do that? Oh, it's super simple. They're going to pull up to the window. You say what real mean because it's inconvenient for you to take their order even though you work here. Now, they're going to give you their order. You make sure you get it wrong because we want them to come back. They're going to say they're not going to come back, but we're McDonald's. We got dollar burgers and we're open 24-7. So, uh, go to the window and get to working. My name is Richard. Come on, Randy, just go to the window. <sighs> okay. God. All right, work in the drive-thru. At least I don't have to touch that poor people food. Can I have some food? Ew, did you sneeze on the window? I'm hungry. Oh, you're hungry? Well, do you have money? No. Well, then what are you going to give me for food? Tomato. Ew, I don't want your poor tomato. We don't accept tomatoes here. I'm, I'm hungry. Well, shoot, get out of here. Shoot. Ew, poor. Ugh. Raymond, did I just see you spray Windex at one of our customers? Yeah, because he was poor. <sighs> Raymond, Raymond, Raymond. Look, all of our customers are poor. You just can't spray them with Windex, though. How about we have the perfect conversation you're supposed to have at the window? You be the driver, I'll be me. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. In my Lamborghini. Whatever. <sighs> what do you want? Why aren't you at Burger King? Why are you ordering here? Can I get a cheeseburger? A cheeseburger? <sighs> Windex is right down the street. All right, just pull up to the next window. See, it's that simple. See, now, you don't have to spray people with Windex, okay? Yeah. Let's forget my order wrong. And you want $15 out. You know what? Go, go ahead of the burgers. I got this. Did you just throw something at me? Uh-huh. I bought a tomato from a homeless man because I ran out of bananas. What do you want from me, lady? I just want my order right because my booger had nuggets and fries on it. Ain't that what you wanted? No, I wanted it all separately. You know what? Look, here's your tomato back. All right, scram, lady. Oh, and you want $15? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. $15 an hour. <sighs> All right, Ryan. I don't know how much longer I can work here. Me either. Look, I'm dreaming of bigger and better things. Right? Like working at Chick-fil-A. But see, the customers here, it's so annoying. And poor. That too. <sighs> oh, another one. You won't. And can you please stop honking your horn? Hey, I stole my dad's car because he wouldn't bring me to get a Happy Meal. Cool, cool, cool. What do you want? Uh, can I get a cheeseburger Happy Meal with three toys? Uh, the Happy Meal only come with one toy. Well, I want three toys. You only getting one toy. How about three toys? It comes with one toy. Three toys! One toy! Three toys! Okay! Okay! okay.
All right, Robbie, we got another bad customer at the drive-thru. You know how I knew? Because of the color of the car? Exactly. The color of the car was red, so you knew he's gonna be mean. And he wanted a Happy Meal with three toys. Look, this ain't Toys R Us. I'm not giving him all them toys. You know what we're gonna do to his food? We're gonna spit in the food? Bingo. You learn it, Robbie. Okay, so uh, fix the food and remember the song, okay? Okay. All right, the song. Uh, sometimes there's meat, bunch of bunch of cheese, lot of lot of lettuce, uh, a couple chicken nuggets, maybe a few tomatoes, um, ketchup, 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 and then maybe the whole thing. Uh, mustard, 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 mustard. Uh, okay, that looks good. All right, it's ready. Let me check the Happy Meal and see how you did. Wait, Rachel, you're not supposed to give them all the ketchup and mustard. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. Uh, let me get them a drink. Yeah. Here's your Happy Meal with the three toys. Oh, thank you. You're not welcome. Uh. All right, Rufus. I'm going to end your shift early today since it's your first day. What does that mean? That means you get to go home. Oh, thank God. Charge, come pick me up in the helicopter. All right, I'm going to get your check, and then you can go home, okay? How much money did I make? Well, you only worked for like 10 minutes, so uh, you made about 75 cents. Ew, poor. <laughs> welcome to the club. Oh, Dad, I'm back from work. Wait a minute. Ew, you smell poor! I know, but I got paid. Hold on, let me see that. 75 cents. Congratulations, you've made enough money to buy three gumballs. Oh, Dad, I have a confession to make. I don't want to be poor. I don't want to work at poor restaurants anymore. And, and I'll even wipe my butt with 20s. Listen, son, you don't have to wipe your butt with 20s. That would be a disgrace to the Goodman name. We only wipe our butts with hundreds. But the fact that you said that you would wipe your butt with 20s shows that you appreciate money now. So let's go home and get out of this weird poor person's house. Oh, thank you, Dad. I love you so much. I love you too, son. Let's go.